Hello, this is Supercaf TV here once again. Today we have the deluxe wooden kitchen with breakfast bar. Bought this from Argos today for £120. This is a little unboxing, building, and a bit of a review at the so end. So, going to open the box. Inside we have the instructions on the build itself so there's a quite a lot to follow before you do buy this make sure you do have the patience as you need to build this it doesn't come ready made of course okay so there's quite a few parts to follow in terms of assembly instructions they'll be here for a while i believe quite a few pages but at the end we will get there the main part you guys want to see of course is the physical product at the end so I'm gonna fast forward all this once I've built it and I'll take you through all the key features of this kitchen set it's like we've got most of the plastic bits in here and looks like all the wooden bits are in here that need assembling together Okay, so this took approximately four hours to assemble. I must say that it is a great looking kitchen set. For £120, you can't go wrong in terms of what you are getting for the money. So what we'll do now is just uh, go through a little bit of the features of the product itself. First one being this tap. It's got a little bit of a water sound effect. Next one, these burners, I think is that one there. It's got a bit of a sound effect and lights up as one of these small things are pressed. Okay, so these dials, they're just, don't have any sort of batteries or anything that's needed, only these batteries go in just to make a little bit of a noise that's all so they don't have any real function so in total you do need nine batteries all together so that's three in the tap the same amount in one of the hobs same again in the other hob and this little clock over here so that's 12 all together that you do need I imagine they will last a long time because they don't really serve much purpose than just a little bit of sound effect these here are just little beeps. Don't imagine the batteries taking up a lot of power just to create that little function there. So the rest of the kitchen set, obviously there's little dials again, same function just like here. Same sound effect, microwave there. So here we have the toaster. Perfect. As mentioned before, all the doors open they do function i would use this as storage throw all the kids toys in here look as you can see there's a galaxy tab here box there um but this is a pretty cool function as well so i'll get my assistant here to test this ice cube function out brilliant it's great stuff so again, the fridge doors open, plenty of storage in there, some accessories that can be bought, so it looks like a fridge in there, eventually. But as you can see at the moment, all kinds of stuff is getting stored in here. Overall guys, I do recommend this. For £120, you do get a lot for the money that you pay. However, big downside is the assembly. Not everyone has four hours to spare to assemble their children's toy. So for that, I would say think carefully before you do go out there and purchase it for your child. But once you do get past that stage, as you can tell, it is a good set. It should keep your children busy for the years to come. Make sure that you have got some space available as it is pretty large, the whole set. 
So before you do go outside and buy one, assemble it, etc. Just make sure that you've got enough space in the room. So okay. as you can see, she's keeping herself busy already. Left the tap on. We need to save those batteries, remember. Apart from the small negatives of assembly and some of the parts not being the best quality, overall the set does look good. So I would actually recommend it. £120 from Argos. Most stores have them in stock. If you do want this for Christmas, I would say try to get one earlier. Especially considering the fact it takes four hours to build. Oh, well, thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe, share and like. Drop us a comment on what kind of toys you would actually like us to review. Obviously we are a growing channel, so any little support of subscribing, commenting and liking is greatly appreciated. So thanks for watching once again guys, see you again next time.